Hi, and welcome once again to Stone Soup. The world according to sci-fi geeks. We're you? sorry for that week-long absence. My dear mother here had a very nasty cold flu something. She could barely speak. And it's uh, really hard to do if you're just whispering. Yeah. But and I'm back. Hello. Greetings. And Here as you are. can see, we've been doing science. Do you want to be Adam or Jamie? Mm. I'll be Adam. No, Jamie. I'll be Jamie because he's the sensible one. Right. Anyway. <laughs> what we... They're both blonde. Anyway, actually, I don't know that Jamie actually has yeah, hair. Really. He wears his hat all the time. Anyway. Oh, see without his hat. What do we have here, you might wonder? Well, we were making pecan extract. We mentioned this three weeks ago. Uh -huh. We well, took one cup of shelled pecans and two cups of 151 rum. We, we did this twice. We took yes. one batch and we blanched the pecans according to the instructions that we got off the net. Which uh, was to place refers to boiling them to get rid of the uh, what's the word the tannins the tannins which are bitter yes we boiled them only for ninety seconds because you don't want to kill the flavor right yes and then you you seal them up with uh, one cup of pecans to two cups of one fifty one mm -hmm. one rum and wait for three weeks yes today was three weeks mm -hmm. we decanted them notice our nifty nifty um, bottles bottles like the heterodyne bottles aren't <laughs> they cool we got these at Michael's. Like and uh, they're very cool. Mm -hmm. And so we decanted it. And I, t and I tasted it with a, a, a teaspoon. Just, you know, take a teaspoon out. It's rum. There's no pecan in it. Mm -hmm. It's not pecan rum. It's just, just the rum. rum. The pecans now, are in there are very rummy now, too. But Yeah, the pecans are very rummy, but the rum isn't very pecan -y. Yes. So my husband said, well, bake some cupcakes mm -hmm. and, you know, divide them into three because we have the blanched, the unblanched, and then vanilla for a, a control. Yes. Now, as far as the science, you know, the instructions say blanch the pecans, okay? But when we were first doing that, my mother noticed when she ate one of the pecans that there was no flavor left in the pecan, it seemed. So my father, being very scientific-minded, being an engineer and all, suggested that we try a second batch that was un unblanched to see if that changed anything. By the, by the way, this took up the entire bottle of 150, 151 rum, which was relatively expensive, from our point of view, at least. Anyway, so... Mm -hmm. I made the cupcakes. Now, we have a control cupcake here. Yeah, it's a small cake. Like the cupcakes from the cupcake tin were hideous. But, I but mean, they, they taste they fine. They taste fine. They tore apart when we tried to get them out. out. Gourmet cupcake I, makers, we are not. <laughs> yeah, I need to go ask the ladies at Double D what I'm doing wrong. But mm -hmm. So this is our control. I, I had bad you cake. <laughs> Yeah, bad cake. <laughs> Sit, stay. Okay, good texture. If we won't taste it, who will? Mm -hmm. He will. <laughs> Your timing is impeccable. <laughs> I'll get back to you. Moist. Mm -hmm. Good texture. A li little too much uh, Crisco, I think. Mm. Now, this is actually a combination of both the... Uh, this, by the way, is the, the blanched, very pale, mm -hmm. and this is the unblanched, dark and beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's now, a lovely color. It doesn't taste like pecan. Now, there's actually a pecan down in the center of this. It sank. I put pecans, I'll put pecans on the top of my, my banana mm -hmm. bread so that I, I know, to let people know there's <gasps> nuts in it. Yes. You know, so they don't, and an angle looks you know, pretty. People who are allergic, so they won't eat it. Mm -hmm. So here we and go. Oh, it looks pretty. And I just put my arm in dog drool. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Rum. 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 You giving your dog rum? I'm giving him rum cake. <laughs> the actual alcohol has been cooked out. Yes. It doesn't taste bad. But it doesn't taste like pecans. At all. Not one hint of pecan. I'm very upset. Mm -hmm. I have several fancy little bottles. Mm -hmm. And there are two more of these. Six little bottles of rum. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. Do you have a drink? No, fine. 
something. Well, of course, if I was really being Adam, at this point, I would be saying, well, let's see if it's still 151 proof. Let's get a match. Whoosh. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Hey! <laughs> oh, by the way, you want to make a comment about, you search, you can't find real pecan extra. Yes, I was going to. Thank you for reminding me. Okay, now, are you ready, Adam? Um, ready, Jamie. <laughs> You must be Tori. <laughs> <laughs> I just like it here, here now that I'm not sure this is a good idea. <laughs> it's burning. It's burning. Oh, yep. How cool is that? That is so cool. <laughs> Settle down. Shush, puppy. Okay, how do we put it out? <laughs> Like that. Do okay. I still have eyebrows? <laughs> yeah, the eyelashes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think so. Okay. <laughs> I that was a little exciting. <laughs> yes, it was. Adam I mean, and Jamie I... would die <laughs> at how idiotic we are to be excited about that. Uh -huh. <laughs> they blow stuff up. <laughs> we have a little flambe and it freaks us out. Oh, by the way, speaking of pecan extract, one reason we tried to do it ourselves is I looked all over the internet. I can't find a place to get pure pecan extract. Mm -mm. And most like of the this. imitation doesn't look like it's worth getting. Nope. You know, Although I, I may go ahead and order some anyway. I mean, maybe maybe there's some kind of specialty store where we could find some, but we wouldn't know which one. It's certainly not at any of the regular stores. That was fun. <laughs> uh, there is a brief discussion about maybe trying again with something like, what's it called, Everclear? Yeah, Everclear, which has no flavor of its own. Yeah. So we'd either get, you know, nice pecan-flavored Everclear or mm -hmm. no flavor at all. No flavor at all, which would tell us that this there's a reason this didn't work. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we should have waited another week. But it says three. Uh -huh. It says this is direct from the net. After three weeks, strain the pecans, and you will have a gorgeous pecan extract. Uh, no. This extract has a very long shelf life and needn't be refrigerated. Well, I wouldn't know about that. My extract is only a day old. Yep. However, I intend to keep such things in the ice chest as it always helps to keep the flavor from fading. Well, there is no flavor except booze. Uh -huh. You don't have to worry about that. Nope. It don't fade. You know, not pecan booze, just booze. booze. And it is very pretty to look at, but... And the bottles are like beyond cool and stuff. Yes. But <laughs> I can think of all kinds of way to pl ways to play with these bottles. Oh, yeah. You know, Halloween, oh. brightly colored liquids and a little bit of dry ice. <laughs> Oh, yeah. We're going to have fun next Halloween. <laughs> of course. But, uh, how am I going to wash these things? Can I get bottle brushes. Oh. They'll have to get one. Mm -hmm. You're right. That's going to be a problem. I suppose we oh, could no. have mixed drinks, but I'm trying to think what... I don't drink rum, so I don't know what you mix them with. Rum and Coke? Me either. I've heard. Mm -hmm. My husband drinks Diet Coke. I can just imagine super expensive rum in Diet Coke. <laughs> <laughs> That's just <laughs> offensive. I was at a party once where they ran out of Coke, so they substituted Dr. Pepper. Do you know what rum and Dr. Pepper tastes like? Vitamins. <laughs> yeah, crap. <laughs> Liquid vitamins. That's what it tasted like. It was like, okay. Weird. I no. thought it was worse. <laughs> I mean, it, it, uh, at least it didn't taste like cough syrup. <laughs> yeah, well, not current. This was like 40 years ago. Oh. Anyway. Shortly after the Big Bang. <laughs> I'm glad you all couldn't hear that. My husband just made a crude <laughs> remark about my, my, my age, and I'm, I'm young and beautiful and tender, and he's an idiot. And so there. <laughs> well, you said it was 40 years ago. That's what he was commenting on, not your age. Yeah, right. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 40 years ago, when I was still old enough to drink booze. Hello. Can we help you guys? This is my other friend, not the one who was here before. This is Julius. The one who was here before is over here with me. Yeah. <laughs> This is my boys. They say, you have cake. Can we have cake? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, I don't uh, know why you wrong. The cakes flavor. are The cakes do taste nice, but they taste like rum. Mm. They're rum cakes. And we were hoping for pecan, pecan cakes. Bite for you. I mean, even I if the, this actual recipe we'll was mostly for intended Dad. for making a kind of pecan mix to drink, hence the hardcore rum, you're not going to get any pecans out of this. There is not one bit a, a pecan, pecan in flavor. there. So, I, don't, I mean, I even went up to this guy's website a little while ago to say, 
no pecan flavor. So now he'll maybe he'll he'll post and say, "Well, this is what you did wrong." Well, I can hope. I can only hope I did exactly what it said there. Uh-huh. I mean, it's not like our, I, I I don't think the problem was that our container wasn't sealed tight enough because if that was an issue, all the alcohol would have evaporated. And as we just demonstrated, the alcohol is very much still there. there. Yeah. Whoosh. Plus, we still had two full cups of, of fluid in each one, uh-huh. so no, it so, did no, not evaporate. Sealed Hello. Tight enough. And we did the measurements <laughs> like they said. You are a silly dog. So, anyway, that was our experiment. Mm-hmm. It was a lot of fun, but it did not produce pecan extract. Okay. If you know how to get pecan extract, let me know. Please share. I've yeah. tried Trader Joe's, uh, tried regular grocery stores. Mm-hmm. As you said, scoured the net. Scoured the net. Have not seen it. Mm-hmm. So, at least we got some cool bottles out of it. Yeah, I did get some really cool bottles out of it. And, and some really expensive booze that we'll find something to do with if I know your dad. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.